All right. Well, you know what? We're going to get into our next match, and I think you guys are going to like what's coming up next. Shout out to Jutsu popping off in the background. But we're about to see Tech Chase and your boy, Mike Kirby. HO3K, Mike Kirby. I hope that I said his uh, sponsor's name right. Can't remember how it's said, actually. I'm going to ask him after this. Right now, we just got to marvel at this Kirby now. Yeah. Like we said, this is not a Kirby from our region at all, but definitely regarded as one of the best Kirby players, if not the best, on the planet. So, y'all are in for a treat. Make sure you look for this guy's punish game, because as we're seeing, it's pretty gnarly. 50%? Are you and, joking? And that's all off of tilts and aerials. And I was talking with Kirby Kid earlier, and he let me in that Kirby's biggest strengths are that his tilts are incredible. His down tilt is super low profile. His up tilt has invincibility, and his forward tilt just has a ton of range. There's really nothing that Kirby's tilts can't do. And look, Kirby's tilts have got him at 907%. It might not be Smash 64, Kirby, but you're right. These up tilts are putting in a lot of work for Ooh. Mike Kirby. Mike Kirby is going oh. ducks <laughs> under the grab. Yeah, that might Tech Chase laughing at all. 10% is all he's got on him right now, and Mike Kirby getting some more action in there. You see him mixing it up, not just up tilts, but up airs as well. Chase eating up a lot of damage here. And yeah. he's having a hard time finding any openings because of something you mentioned. Mike Kirby able to low profile just under a lot of Tech Chase's options. And you just saw their little preview of what's going to happen if Mike Kirby gets to those higher percents, is that because of how quickly Kirby can air dodge and then jump again, Kirby's going to do that a lot. It's just air dodge and jump, air dodge and jump. It's very hard to hit Kirby when he's doing that. And a big thing about that last stock is I think he might have made it so that Tech Chase isn't comfortable throwing out any grabs. That's going to make it even harder for him, I feel, to take this stock. Kirby dancing around. <laughs> Tech Chase definitely feeling the pressure here. Chase having a lot of trouble just finding an opening. And Kirby being so light and so tiny, it's really hard to land a lot of the signature ZSS combos on him. The walks from Mike Kirby. He wants to be able to access that tilt so quickly. And that's just that's just what you gotta do with Kirby. And Tech Chase, I mean, it's a little surprising, but Tech Chase plays against Zanzi a whole lot. And, you know, he's probably got some of the biggest Kirby experience out of the people here. And he's kind of, for lack of better words, getting bucket. I was going to say bodied. Yeah. yeah, he's getting bodied. It's looking like a like quick... Uh... You can't see him right now, but yeah, JV has one hand and a fist. It's 20. Another it's hand 20. with a V. It's 20. It's 20. Tech Chase is going to be beaten 20 games to nothing, <laughs> according to JV. Yep, totally. Totally. Um, from Tech Chase, honestly, a, a big part was uh, I feel like it was Mike Kirby's punish game. Yeah. But also the effects of some of the punishes that we saw from Mike Kirby made it so that Tech Chase was really put on tilt very quickly. Uh, he, I feel like he felt like a lot of his options when it comes to starting up a lot of his combos were shut down pretty quickly. We didn't see that much pair of the, uh, the stun gun because Mike Kirby would duck underneath them, would see so much of the whip because when he tried to go for the grab, he got half smash and he died for it. Yeah. Uh, it just felt like a lot of his approach options overall got shut down by some of the little things that Mike Kirby was doing. So it's not a surprise to me that we're going to be seeing the Robin for game two. Yeah, and if I'm honest, I feel like the Robin is actually Tech Chase's more solid character these days. He's very good at using Robin's uh, spacing and projectiles to the advantage, playing Robin as a tactician that he is. But uh, Robin being pretty heavy, uh, Mike Kirby might have a field day with his combos. 49% already and almost getting that downer. Very dangerous to go off stage against Robin, especially if you end up under him. He can use that L1 to spike you, but Mike Kirby with no fear dunking right under that arc fire and 81% done on him already. There's one thing that Kirby's have been, and that's comfortable whenever it comes to the off stage game. We haven't seen a whole lot of that yet from Mike Kirby. I'm sure that he's probably just saving it for a moment where Tech Chase is not expecting it. Yeah, and look at this. Got him off stage again and almost getting hit by that L1. Not the spike one, obviously, but still a dangerous place to be, especially if he can just go off and L1 again. And uh, 
dangerous places indeed. And this time for Tech Chase. She's in a footstool, but he's not getting really any damage. He was trying to change his character for the openings. Oh, did he catch? He caught the sword. Did he catch the sword in midair? That was low key godlike. <laughs> that is Yo. actually really cool. <laughs> he's not. I don't think he's walking away with the game, but he. But, but he gets the. He gets like the godlike seal of approval or something. Yeah. <laughs> that was goofy. Also, what's goofy? Robin with uh, Kirby with Robin here. That's a little. Looks goofy. a little bit like Raiden actually. Uh, looks more <laughs> like a uh, Robert Durst. Shout out to the Robert Jinx. Durst. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, I did not kill my wife. <laughs> <laughs> For right. the three people that got that reference, All right. that show's amazing. I'm an episode away from finishing it. But anyways, I think we're a stock away really oh from finishing God. this. Kirby's callouts for for the for the Thunder Arts are so adorable. All right, well, even for sense now, except uh, one of these people is on one stock. Oh, oh man! Listen to that. That's so adorable. And that's gonna be it. That was a cute attempt at a recovery, but Tech Chase knows that it's over. That handshake! That was... <laughs> I, I didn't catch it. Somebody odd shot that one. <laughs> Homie, at least get the handshake right. <laughs> you know, uh, shout out to Tech Chase. That dude's super great. Sometimes uh, the wrong handshake is the right handshake. I agree. I agree. It makes for great GR Smash videos. But, no, you know, shout out to Tech Chase for sure. You know, he's a, he's a great dude. Mike Kirby, man, he's just on, like, a whole nother level. And like we said, he's one of our favorites for the evening. Yeah, and... Uh, I think I just figured out uh, his sponsorship is actually a uh, Ho3K, because that's uh, John Numbers is or was sponsored by Ho3K, and that's a uh, tri-state group. So that makes sense for anybody who doesn't know that. That makes sense. So uh, yeah, I'm really excited to see Kirby go the distance here. Oh Speaking of Kirby, Zanzi's right here. Zanzi, how's it going? Oh. Zanzi with the callouts. I won't repeat what he said on stream. <laughs> Zanzi a little salty about which time. <laughs> 